Well, we're back today with a quick follow-up flight of the Twin Otter by E-Flight. What an awesome plane. We had an amazing maiden flight experience over Labor Day weekend. Hopefully you guys aren't too sad going back to work after a long extended weekend. If you are, hopefully this video cheers you up just a little bit. We're gonna fly for fun today. Just a follow-up to let you guys know it's not a one and done plane. I've really enjoyed my time with this. The main reason I bought it for those props. Those props alone are the selling point. I want to see more props like this striped on all RC planes. I think every single RC plane moving forward. Chrome tips, different colored stripes. It looks amazing. I'm all about it. And I will say, if I could award, if I could hand out awards, I don't know. Who, who gets to decide who hands out awards? Right? I, if I could hand out awards, this is probably the best looking 3S plane of 2020 that I can think of. It's amazing. If you can think of another nice looking airplane that flies on 3S, let me know in the comments below. I'm always looking at other airplanes and stuff, but this, to me, takes the cake. You've got lights, the tricycle landing gear. Let's not forget that it comes with water pontoons. Hold on, come on. Dun, 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 dun. Water pontoons. <laughs> that was good. That's good. I love it. It also has a steerable rudder on those water pontoons. You better believe that if we survive the flights today, the next time you see this puppy will be flying on and off of water. The nerves are going crazy, of course. Well, guys, let's put a battery in. Let's fly and enjoy this bright, beautiful sky that God gave us to fly in today. I usually don't do this, Abby, but let's do a nice little pirouette out here so everyone can see those props. Woo! <laughs> okay, no flaps. We're just gonna juice it and take off. Oh wow! There we go. We're in the air. That was fast. Nice short takeoff. Ah, oh, what a beautiful plane! What a beautiful plane! This is gonna look so good flying off of a lake somewhere. We've got to pick a nice lake that we can get like maybe beach access to or something, and go fly this. Oh, it's gonna be fun. Well, maybe I have to get a couple pontoon planes and hit them up at the same time. I've got another plane in mind that I'd like to like to pick up that's also compatible with having uh, pontoons. So yeah, this is one of the best looking planes in the sky on the ground. It just looks sweet. And I talked about this in the last video, but those props that you're looking at are actually branded Dow props. They are not just some cheap chintzy propellers. They should be able to take a beating and keep coming back for more. In my experience with race drones and my Dow props, they bend. They don't break. You can tumble through a field and pick it back up and bend it back into shape and keep flying. Not the greatest for flight footage, but if you need to finish a race or something, it works out really well. That's a, I must be popular today. <laughs> Have a little bit of cell service here. Okay, this thing is pretty. Let's throw safe off and climb. ka -chow! And we'll just roll it right over. Maybe we can do some Cuban eights with this. We did not do that in our maiden, so let's see if we can pull one off. Yeah, there we go. There's half of it. Can I finish it? There it is. Nice Cuban eight. Nice. We'll throw safe back on. Very, very good. I'll tell you what, guys, if you missed our maiden video, safe saved me a couple of times from a crash in the maiden flight. I was getting a little bit brave and I threw that safe switch and it really came in handy. It's amazing technology. Now, I mean, when you guys tune in to watch our videos, hopefully you have a good time. But recently, you know, we've been trying to reach out to a couple people and see if we can save you guys some money. And in one of these big companies that has said, you know what, we love the RC sailors, we love new members in the hobby. Someone that wanted to work with us is AMA. So we got a hold of them and said, hey guys, for my birthday, could we do something special and bring everybody a promo code? A lot of new people watch our videos, new to the hobby, and uh, AMA said, yes, absolutely, let's do the promo code. So to celebrate my birthday and new pilots in aviation and keep everyone as safe as possible, we have a special exclusive RC Sailor promo code down in our description box where you find the links to all the good stuff, where you find the link to this. There will be links to batteries that we use to fly this, the radio that I'm using to fly this, and a nice link to bring you right to AMA if you want to sign up for membership where the Academy of Model Aeronautics not aviation, right, Abby? Right. Aeronautics. <laughs> they'll, 
They provide insurance for the RC hobbyist, airplane flyers, helicopter drones, even RC car and truck guys. I, I don't know if you guys knew that, but I've learned that recently. They provide insurance for us all, and they have really nice magazines that you get in the mail every month. Uh, I love flipping through the magazines. They have really nice articles. I've learned things about batteries in those magazines. That's kind of how I know so much about batteries. I've learned a lot in those articles. So if you guys want to sign up for AMA, I highly recommend it. I think that anybody that flies RC planes, whether you're flying in a private field, a sanctioned AMA field, or you're at a flying event, before you ever touch the sticks to your radio, I think you should have AMA. I always have my entire life flying RC planes. There's no reason not to. It's affordable and uh, you need it. And now you can save some money. So all the good stuff will be down there. I think we should throw safe off and climb again. What do you think, Abby? Yep. Okay, here we go. There, there's a time limit on that too, by the way, guys. The promo code ends in like a week or so. Climbing. We'll finish it off with a little bit of inverted flight. I always fly inverted so much higher than I fly any other way, but it'll get a little lower. Could you imagine how high I would fly inverted? if I was inverted? I don't know if you could see the plane anymore. <laughs> well, let's see if we can pull out this way. Yes, we can. Oh my gosh, safe, baby, safe. Please save me. Wow. What safe just happened? So, so I kind of went into like an upside down flat spin without you were spinning. You like a loop-de-loop. -loop. That was awful. That was absolutely awful. And that was one of the best examples of safe coming in handy that I've ever seen. I don't know that I could have recovered from that as low as I was, which is why I don't like to fly <laughs> inverted. And I tried to finish my inverted flight with an outside loop. And that was scary, scary, scary. <laughs> oh my gosh. I threw safe and I just thought, please work, please work, please work. And it did. Of course it did. There's my five minute timer. We can fly a little bit longer on this battery. Uh, let's just do that. Let's just keep flying on this battery. In the, in the maiden flight, we realized that we could get at least three or four more minutes on these batteries. So instead of switching out batteries, let's just keep pushing this one and see if we can uh, keep it in the air for longer. Let's shoot for a longer flight. Were you looking for an airplane, Abby? I saw yeah, you looking I was around. just checking the skies for you. That's my job. I want to test something. I usually talk the whole video. When I fly for fun, I don't talk. Believe it or not. You guys, you wouldn't believe it. I'm quiet. I just get quiet and I enjoy the flight. When that camera's turned off, my mouth is turned off. <laughs> Thank I know it goodness. Seem, it's, I know, I know, hard to believe, but it's the truth. I'm gonna try to see if I can give you guys about 30 solid seconds of quiet airplane. All right, time. are you ready? <laughs> oh, hey, there's no a, screaming, no screaming. There was a bee. Right, okay, go. Whoa, was that as awkward for you as oh, it was yeah, for wow. me? Super, super awkward. <laughs> right oh when you hit 30 God. seconds, I was like, someone do something. Somebody do it, please. <laughs> uh, you know what? Honestly, I was enjoying the flight. But I mean, either we just lost everybody there or they're <laughs> freaking out. We got more thumbs down on this video than ever before. <laughs> and you know what? For having already pushed our past five minute timer on this little 3S 2200mm battery, it's getting really good performance. It was climbing super great. Watch, we'll do it again. We're just gonna turn safe off, throttle up and climb. Even at that amount of flight time, it's doing a really good job. Wow, when the sun hits this at certain angles, it almost looks like a real metal airplane. You get that glisten of the sun reflecting off of it. Let's get in nice and low here. Touch and go, bounce and go. That was a little fast. <laughs> No flaps. Let's try that again. Why don't we do more touch and goes here? We should. I love this beautiful blue sky today with just those white fluffy clouds back there. What a pretty day to fly. Oh, the wind. The wind. Oh, can I? Double oh, bounce. Goodness, that was embarrassing. I meant to do that. That was, the first one was one bounce. That one was two. 
<laughs> can you do three? Can I do three? We'll try because I'm going to come You're in for a landing. Minutes. Okay, so let's bring it in for a landing. I told you guys in the maiden we'd do a half flap landing, so let's bring it into half flaps there. Safe is on. We've got some wind today, and I am never ashamed to use the technology at my fingertips, not just to make me look better, but to save my airplane, to bring it back in one piece so I can fly again another day. So half flaps? Half flaps, and it's feeling much better. Oh my gosh. This is a half flap lander those if props. I've ever seen one. Beautiful props. Let's circle that around just so we can see those props again. Woo, woo, look at him spinning. Oh man, that's nice. <laughs> <laughs> this is just one of those planes that when you bring up to your flying spot, you can kind of get lost in the imagination of pretending like you're flying on it or just cruising around. I really will fly another battery on this today where I don't say a word and I just zone out and I truly enjoy watching this thing just cruise around, getting as many glimpses of those black and white stripe props coming around as I go. I really love this hobby. It is my zen. It's where I just kind of zone out and just, just put it all in the controls of the airplane. You know, I, after I'm flying, after I'm done flying for the day, I just have this big weight lifted off my shoulders, even on crash days, because they do happen. <laughs> uh, but I really, I'm just truly in love with this hobby. And I love the fact that YouTube exists I get to share these experiences with you guys, let you know what products are crap to avoid and hopefully save people money. So there's actual value to our videos, but then also just getting to share an experience like this, the good products, the, the things that are worth talking about and uh, having those experiences in life that are positive and getting to share them with you guys. I've always wanted to have a, like a vlog channel, kind of, but really it's just like, we hey, do. I, well, did. we do, we do, but did. like, but all we do on it is say, I ate this new Snickers bar that came out and it made me happy. That's what you did on the channel. So I want to share that experience with you guys and hopefully it makes you happy. But you know, we've, we've honed it into just the RCs. Thank goodness, right? I don't think people could keep up with that. You try this new spaghetti sauce, it's amazing. Well, the Twin Otter <laughs> is the new spaghetti sauce in my life that is amazing and I think that everybody should try it. Okay, it is beautiful. So that's and the first, comparing an RC plane to spaghetti sauce. I just awesome. know no one else in the whole world has ever done that. And, and I also think that no one else in the world has ever recommended an airplane on the wing struts alone. If there was some way that I could mail this plane to every person watching this video, just so you could take the wing struts on and off, I would. It's that awesome. And especially if you've ever put wing struts on an airplane before. Should I show them now? I feel like I should. So if you want to take your wing struts off, here we go, are you ready? Ready. These puppies, I haven't actually taken them off yet. <laughs> Pop off here and slide out there. That's amazing. That is amazing because usually wing struts are like bending and prying and popping and doing these tiny little screws that suck so bad. Here's how you take your wing on and off and other than that thumb screw on top. You just slide your wing strut in there and then you pop this into place. It is so rewarding. It is just like popping bubble wrap, but 10 times better. It's amazing. <laughs> the Twin Otter belongs in your collection. If you click our link and it shows it's on back order, do yourself a favor and just put yourself on the list. Those back orders, unfortunately, what you gotta do is slap your order in there and then you're on a, a list that you can't see and when they get them in stock, they'll send it to you. So it's totally worth it. I highly recommend you fly on the batteries we're flying on. They will save you money long term, I promise. And the overall health of your batteries will give you better performance too. All the good stuff that we use to fly will be linked down below, as well as the AMA discount. If you're gonna sign up for it, do it now. You got about a week left or so before they discontinue that amazing promo code to celebrate my birthday. I'm getting so old. Guys, today was a fun day. Bright, beautiful, clear skies to fly in and I just couldn't be happier. It's an awesome, awesome day. This is what it's all about. And for that, I thank God. I also thank our amazing Patreon supporters because without you guys, we could not keep gas in the tank to get up here to fly these planes and share these experiences as often as we do with you guys. It's all because of our Patreon supporters. We have new people signing up all the time. We sincerely thank you guys from the bottom of our hearts and we'll have stickers coming out to you guys to put on your RCs. 
very soon before this plane ever touches water. I promise it's gonna have some RC Sailor stickers on there to help keep it afloat. Did you know that our stickers also act as floating devices? Yes, they do. They help keep your airplanes and boats afloat. Guys, all the good stuff's linked in the description box below. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you over at our maiden flight video of this awesome twin otter. Thanks for watching. We'll see you there. Bye.